Prostate enlargement, also known as benign prosthetic hyperplasia, is a very common problem that affects millions of men as they get older. I mean, it's one of these problems that almost every man are going to face in their lifetime. And then the symptoms of an enlarged prostate can really be frustrating because it can severely affect your quality of life. Those things you, you enjoy doing, you're not going to be able to do them when you have an enlarged prostate because you're going to have painful urination, frequent urination, and things like that, all right? But research has shown that zinc intake can help to prevent and treat prostate enlargement, can help to shrink an enlarged prostate. But the big question is, how much of this nutrient do you really need to shrink your prostate, and how long do you have to be on it? That is what we want to talk about in this video. And if I were you, I would stick to the very end of this video because if you skip any part of this video, you may actually miss some vital information. Now it is official that majority of people with prostate issue, be it prostate cancer or prostate enlargement, have zinc deficiency. Now in prostate cancer tissue, zinc may level decrease up to 80% compared to normal tissue. And then for individuals with benign prosthetic hyperplasia, it decreases by 61%. And if you haven't known this before now, the prostate gland contains a relatively high concentration of zinc than any other gland and tissue of your body because zinc helps to regulate the proper functioning of your prostate, including the growth of the prostate. And then what's interesting is that older men above 55 usually have lower zinc status. I mean, this is one of the reasons why enlarged prostate is most common among older population, all right? So what are these things that could possibly make you to be deficient in zinc? What causes zinc deficiency? Now, you can be deficient in zinc when you have inflammatory bowel diseases like Crohn's and then alcoholic fatty liver disease because when you have this condition, that can reduce your absorption rate, all right? And then severe or persistent diarrhea can also make you to be deficient chronic renal diseases or kidney diseases, long-term use of proton inhibitors like omeprazole, that can also make you to be deficient in zinc. And then restricted food choices in elderly people can also make them to be deficient in zinc. And the last thing is when you have celiac disease, all right? All of these things can make you to have zinc deficiency. Now, talking about the amount of zinc that is needed to shrink your prostate, now, the recommended dietary allowance for zinc for adult male is usually 11 mg per day. But to shrink an enlarged prostate, larger doses is needed to replenish the concentration of zinc in your prostate. So the amount of zinc you actually need to shrink your prostate is actually 25 mg per day. All right? So because your prostate is already deficient by 61%, so you have to make up for it. And if you are a vegan or you are a vegetarian and you are getting your zinc from plant-based sources, you may actually have to increase your intake by 50%. Because if you are getting your zinc from plant-based sources like legumes and whole grains, these foods actually contain phytate, which is a compound that can bind to zinc and prevent their absorption in your intestine. All right? So when you are consuming zinc from plant-based sources, know that your body is not absorbing all of those zinc because it has phytate in it. So some of the common sources of zinc are oyster, three ounce provides about 74 milligrams, pumpkin seeds, three ounce provides six to seven milligrams, and a raw beef, 3.5 ounce can give you about 4.7 milligrams of zinc. But to shrink your prostate, I would recommend you start taking the zinc supplement as they are more bioavailable and then you can easily calculate the amount you are getting to shrink your prostate, which is 25 milligrams per day, all right? Now, the two supplements I would recommend is zinc picolinate and zinc citrate. They are very available, and then you just have to be taking 25 milligrams every day for three months to shrink your prostate. And if after three months, nothing seems to happen, come back to this channel and I will pay back, all right? I'm promising you that. Thanks for watching.